Right, so I've just cut that, and now you just need to feather out the other end. So you feather that out as well. I mean, you don't, mm, you probably don't necessarily need to feather out the other end, but it just makes it easier um, once it then comes to wrapping the rest of it up. So, um, because you know, the, 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 the top piece, you could probably sand that down after, but um, it just makes the process a little bit, it flows a bit better, to be honest. Um, so, just get that nicely feathered down. Like that. So you've got two ends that are feathered out. So, next, I'd whack that on there. And you just want to make sure that it is going to wrap straight as well. There's nothing worse than it not wrapping straight. Or there or thereabouts. I mean, it hasn't got to be bob on because I normally cut these veneers to about 12 mil wide. So that gives me a bit of room just in case it doesn't wrap straight. More often than not, it doesn't. So, uh, <laughs> It's just the way it goes. Um, so then once you've done that, once you've got it straight, the masking tape does tend to hold it a little bit for you so it doesn't spring off the spring out of your hand. So I just normally use some thin CA, CA glue. Um, I just put a little tiny bit on the end. Just a tiny bit and then just get a cocktail stick just to spread it around a little bit. just on that first little piece and then it's a little bit fiddly but then you've got that wrapped just hold that for a few seconds while that glue just sort of bites into the wood and then literally just carry on gluing that up um, all the way around I'll try and do this before my memory runs out on here um, so there you go look it's, it's, it's stuck like that so then what I'd normally do is just put a little another little piece of CA on there cocktail stick make sure it goes right the way the back down as well and then just ease that up the wood like that just do it a little piece at a time so you don't want glue everywhere and then just pushing that round making sure it's nice and tight hold that next bit for a few seconds just while the glue bites again Just keep going around it like that. Sometimes you'll find that the glue doesn't sort of take sometimes, but you can just go back to it and just reapply it. That's why I use thin CA, just in case that happens. You start using medium and it sort of you, you end up getting a little bit of a sort of a gap in it and stuff like that. So I just take that all the way to the end that 